There are some pretty big fish swimming around in Lake Austin, apparently. This morning, a California fisherman visiting family here got more than he bargained for. Fox 7's Casey Claiborne, live from Lake Austin with the fish story. Casey. Mike, fishing is one of those sports I wish I was good at. I can barely get a worm on a hook, much less catch a decent sized fish. Well, the guy we met here this morning caught a 51 pounder, so we interviewed him about that. During that interview, he caught another fish. Oh, there she is. That is a big fish, 51 pounds, according to the man who caught it and reeled it in from the waters of Lake Austin. That's Reese Bond, middle name James. James Bond, no joke. It is really. My dad said he had to do it to one of us, so I got it. <laughs> Bond was born in England, but lives in California now. He's visiting family here in Texas and thought he'd stop by the lake Tuesday morning. He's from a family of passionate carp anglers, so he's got a pretty sweet setup. This is kind of called a Euro setup is how it works. And so we have alarms to know when we're getting takes or dropbacks is what they call when the fish picks up and swims towards you. When the big fish latched on, Bond says the alarm started screaming. I didn't think it was my personal best when I netted it, but um, sure enough, when we put it on the scales, 51 pounds, so I was well happy with it. You heard that right. This is the biggest fish Bond has ever caught. Yeah, and I fish France. My biggest carp out of France is 48 pounds. So yeah, this tops everything. Bond identified the fish as a smallmouth buffalo. Texas Parks and Wildlife confirmed for Fox 7, and they say it's a member of the sucker family, not to be confused with a carp. Bond has a policy. He doesn't kill and eat the fish he catches. He just lets them go. So he was keeping the big catch in a retaining sling just until his brother could check it out then he'll set the fish free. If you kill all the fish off, then you're not going to have anything to catch. And the way that I look at it, if you catch a 50 pound fish or a 20 pound fish and you kill it, it's never going to grow any bigger. And if I catch a 50 pound fish and I put it back in a couple years time, it could be 60 or 70. You never know. So and us as carp anglers, we're always out there chasing the big ones. Talk about being the 007 of fishing. Reese James Bond caught another fish during our interview. And so I'm playing the fish, and then, yeah, about 10, 15 minutes. And. That fish happened to be bigger than anything I've ever caught. Bond set him free. And that's what it's all about, right there, man. what it's all about. Bond says now he'll be looking for that 60 pounder. That's his next fish. And he may find it, according to the Texas Parks and Wildlife website, the largest smallmouth buffalo caught in Lake Austin weighed in at 70.5 pounds back in 2008. We'll send it back to you.